Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we will be looking at the Nikkor Z28 to 75mm f2.8 lens, the lightest full frame f2.8 standard zoom lens ever created by Nikon. Watching this video will save you a lot of time and is completely free. So sit back and relax. With its fast f 2.8 constant aperture, brilliant low light capabilities, vast depth of field control, versatile zoom range and macro style close focusing, you can really be creative in your images. All in a delightfully lightweight lens. This lens is twice as bright as an f 4 lens. This gives you more control of light, more depth of field options to isolate your subject against a dreamlike background. Shoot wide open for a gentle image that accentuates your subject against a beautifully defocused background. As you stop down the aperture, definition gradually spreads throughout the image, sharpening details across the frame. At its widest 28mm range, this lens is great for wide landscapes, architecture, street scenes and interviews. Smoothly zoom through the sweet spots of the focal length range, 35mm, 40mm and 50mm, up to 75mm, a view that's ideal for portraiture and compressing your depth of field. With its optical design, it can focus as close as 19cm or 7.5 inches. Fill your frame with the smallest details and shoot in tight spaces to reveal epic new views. The entire lens is sealed to prevent dust and water droplets. The front element features an anti-fouling coating that resists dirt, fingerprints, and smudges and is easy to clean. For rapid autofocus, it uses a high-speed stepping motor with minimal mechanical noise. A perfect match for your Z camera's eye detection AF, especially in situations where silence is golden. It is ideal for gimbal work. Use the smooth control ring to make iris adjustments that create a natural shift in brightness. And all the while, the stepping motor is operating in near silence to preserve your audio integrity. Oh, before we move on to the summary of other reviews and conclusion, quite some work was put into that video. So if you want to help and encourage us, please click like and subscribe. To conclude on this lens, a standard zoom opening at f2.8 is ideal for background blur. There was already another professional version, but it costs 2,500 euros. Ouch ouch. Fortunately, Nikon has released this 28-75mm f2.8 which we think is very smart with a very affordable price. In addition, its weight is much lower than a classic 24-70mm f2.8. The constant aperture of f2.8 is the holy grail and it thus allows us to obtain a good image quality. In our opinion, this lens is ideal for low light, landscape or portrait photography. If you have a limited budget but want a lens opening at f2.8, this is a perfect choice. Overall the internet is very positive about this lens, but with a few caveats. Compared to the 24-70mm f4 version, this lens misses the wider 24mm range and has less image quality in the outer edges of the frame. Compared to the 24-70mm f2.8 version, it misses built-in stabilization, no digital display, and no programmable buttons. While these may be missed features, the trade-off seems fair given the cost difference, the 24-70mm s lens costs $2,300 compared to the $1,000 for the 28-75mm. So the conclusion is that this lens checks most of the boxes and is a bargain if purchased at $900. US this ends our review. We hope this video has helped you identify the best lens for your needs. We thank you very much for your support to our channel.